Hello, I'm Glenda Lewis, and here are your headlines from 7 Action News. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention is updating its COVID-19 vaccine guidance. It now says the interval between the first and second doses of Pfizer and Moderna vaccines may be as long as eight weeks for certain people. Under previous guidance, the second doses should be three weeks after the first Pfizer shot and four weeks after the first shot of Moderna. The new guidance says extending the interval may reduce the risk of myocarditis, a type of heart inflammation in males 12 to 39 years old. The CDC says the shorter intervals are still recommended for people who are moderately or severely immunocompromised. Those new guidelines come as Michigan sees its lowest COVID number since August. Today, the state announced nearly 6,000 new infections and 312 additional deaths over a five-day period. That makes the daily average for new cases over 1,100. Governor Gretchen Whitmer signed three bills into law today designed to lower drug costs for Michiganders. Supporters of the bill package say it makes pricing practices more fair, increases transparency, and expands access to prescription medications. The bipartisan legislation is based on recommendations from Whitmer's Prescription Drug Task Force. In 2017, more than 30 percent of Michigan residents stopped taking their meds as prescribed due to the cost. A bill still pending in the legislature would cap the price of insulin at $50 per month. Here's Chief Meteorologist Dave Rexroth now with a check of your 7 First Alert forecast. It is going to be a cold night tonight. We're down around 10, 11, 12 in most cases for lows. Wind chills are approaching zero, I think, by tomorrow morning in some spots. Not too toasty Thursday or Friday either in the upper 20s. These are about 10 degrees uh, lower than we should be this time of year. Uh, the day starts with a little sunshine Thursday. We build the clouds in in the afternoon toward the evening hours, our first chance of snow. But the real snow is going to be Thursday night to Friday morning early, 28 for low, widespread 2 to 3 inches. If you add a little bit more on Friday, it's going to be the northeast side of town, northern Macomb, uh, areas like Lapeer, St. Clair, and Sanilac County as well. A little warmer, not much, but a little bit warmer over the weekend with temperatures in the 30s.